Three and a half minutes, gentlemen. Three and a half minutes. I know I'm the champ. I don't have to keep saying it. They know I'm the champ too. My title is Mr. Olympia. Theirs isn't. And they're trying to get there. They've got to fight me all day. There's no way I'm going to lose. Out your own tunes, develop a playlist, and rock it out so that you can knock it out and make these, you know, these weights your bitch. You know what I mean? And a week for the past eight years just to make sure that I could have that more complete look. It all starts in the gym. I mean, if you can't get to the gym, you can't definitely get full. If you can't get full, baby, there is no shows for you.
all now. <laughs> but, yeah. Sometimes you have to tell yourself, hey, I can stop. You know, I just, I did 40 reps, you know, three times on this. And this, I ain't gonna lie, after the first day I'm saying, I wanted to quit. And uh, I, I very, you know, I could, I could make sense out of it and say, well, I did about 20 sets already. What, uh, who cares about these next two? Well, the guys that I'm getting ready for care because they're going to be doing the same damn thing, if not twice as hard. So that's what you have to think about sometimes and know that, you know, if you want to be a competitive bodybuilder, you want to be competitive at anything, you have to have a killer instinct, you have to have a killer mentality. And it's just you really against the world mentality that I have that has prepared me to be Mr. Olympia and to maintain that and even get to the next level. I can't just do what I did last time. I can't do what I did even last week. Even if I had the best week of my life, I have to make that better. And uh, I guess that's, you know, us facing perfection, of course. You really want to have a lot of method to your madness, meaning that everything you do for these next few days have to have purpose, extreme amount of purpose for what you're trying to do on stage. percent of the time 90 probably 99 percent of the year i don't have a training partner and you know i'm still able to be be mr olympia so i almost tell to you guys what's your excuse you know that oh if that's something you know happened bad in your life well i'm here to tell you it's life baby and you have an opportunity to come into a gym get in a positive mode put your headphones on crank out whatever playlist you can and get it done get something get out of it so when you can walk back out there you can feel like you've When I win this one, I'm always gonna have haters, or I'm always gonna still have naysayers, which is really weird. But I'm going to be able to know that with all that crap said, there is no number 14. Still Phil Heath, three-time champ. <laughs>